July 26th, y'all. The time is going by so fast. I can't believe it's already July 26th. But uh, we're like the end of July. Moms, how y'all doing? Because I don't know about you, but my kids go back to school next week and it's just gonna be crazy. Macy has already been in school. She's been going to school all summer, so nothing's really changing with her except she's going to be in pre-K. So her schedule's gonna change a little bit, but um, I did mention that we're doing after school care for her just because I still will be working, um, you know, doing my training and stuff. So I would need her in school. But I do think that some days I might go get her like on a break because I don't know if I want her to in school from eight to six. That just seems like a long time. But anyways, y'all, my older girls are going into seventh grade. I'm so proud of them for doing their work and holding it down. They'll be in school um, starting next week. So yeah, y'all know Georgia, we start pretty early here. So yeah, um, let me know how you moms are doing with this whole back to school thing. I feel like this year is more smoother versus like last year. I feel like last year was still like very COVID-y and like, you know, just a lot of stuff going on last year. still kind of fresh. I feel like this year, there's a lot more upgrades that I'm seeing in the school. There's a lot more maybe grants given. I don't know, but there's a lot of better improvements. Even in my area, they opened up a brand new high school. Like, I freaking love that. Growing up in my um, hometown, they didn't build new schools. Like, they barely built new schools. Like, whatever you, whatever school you saw was there. Like, you know, so um, definitely didn't like <sighs> get to enjoy those moments. But I'm so happy. Like, I live in a place where they truly upgrade every single day like every single day i walk out of my house there's something new that they're building and i like that i love that that's why i moved to georgia but anyways <laughs> this is like a normal work week i have both of my laptops out and open um i'm sitting in my dining room because it's not that cold for one um it's blasting hot outside but i keep the air nice and chilly in my house and i feel like it has the best lighting i have a great um scenery out the window it just makes me feel happy sitting here my office is cool but that's more for like filming um videos and stuff like that like doing my work it's way too loud up there when the air comes on and i feel like it's so dark even though it's sunny it just doesn't get that much lighting because it only has one window so and i don't want to work out of my bedroom because i fall asleep in my bed <laughs> so here i am in the dining room just chilling in my dining room eating and about to get to work um let me prop y'all somewhere probably not the best um angle but and i just have waffles oh yeah my cocking away sorry i only made myself some waffles this morning um something quick and you know easy to eat so i'm gonna get signed in normally when i start work I pull up like my all of my work stuff <laughs> like me clocking in and like all the stuff that I need for work also you guys I've been reading my book and I am on the hunt for transparent post-its I'm gonna show you some because I'm probably gonna go to the store today and get them last night I went to Walmart thinking that they were there and they weren't disappointment but also not a surprise so I'm gonna go to office max or staples to get the transparent sticky notes because this book is so good like it is just speaking to me like it really is speaking to me so I want to mark the um, passages that I've read but I don't want to ruin my book so I need some transparent sticky notes which I'm going to be looking for <laughs> okay so y'all yeah, I'm so tired it's been a long couple of weeks only because like I said work content creator work content creator like that's all i've been doing mommy 24 7 so bear with me and yes this i'm gonna name this like my work from home shirt until i get another sweater because this is the most comfortable sweater ever and it's bleached up it is bleached up but y'all this is so comfortable like i know it's hot outside but i keep it cold in my house and having a sweater just makes me feel comfy but 
I have an Amazon package. <laughs> Yay, those are always exciting. I ordered this off of Amazon. Okay, so I ordered these transparent sticky notes. Um, they're a pack of 200 sheets. <laughs> so 200 sheets, I just ordered them um, because I want to start to annotate. I think that's how you say it. I think that's what, what, what the correct verbiage is. Annotate. Annotate my book. Oh, these feel so soft. Um, so, I was reading reviews, and to my understanding, these are more so like, um, like wax paper almost, because there is no magical see-through paper, if that makes sense. I put it on the book right here. It's see-through and you can like write your notes or whatever. Is this one or two? Make sure it's like stuck down in there. Okay. So instead of like highlighting and going through all my pages and being all colorful and messing with my book, I can just write the little notes that I wanted to write on my book on the paper. I believe you need a Sharpie pen, which I don't have. I think I do, but I gotta find it. Good morning. It is Friday, Friday. So happy it's Friday, y'all. I am so tired. It's Friday, it is July 29th, and we are starting off the morning with some breakfast. I'm making some breakfast. Don't worry about my pans, y'all. Look like they burn it, but they're not. <laughs> um, it's been a long week, and it's gonna be an even longer weeks ahead with the kids going back to school i'm just praying for strength y'all at this point because but i look at guys you don't see my sticky notes i have been an annotating whatever and that well, y'all know what i mean <laughs> highlighting my book but with my sticky notes i freaking love them um this book has so much like good passages and like just things that i want to remember so yeah, I have a lot, so I'm glad that I bought those sticky notes because I would be doodling in that um, book. I have today and tomorrow to film the vlog. I think I'm gonna go to Target after I get off work today. Hopefully it's an easy day at work. Yesterday it was a pretty chill day at work, so hopefully today it'll be the same. And yeah, that's pretty much it. That's what I wanted to share with you guys too. I am still putting myself out there for brand deals and sponsorships and they have been responding so that's another thing like I have about three sponsorships to get out so you know the content is there you know I'm happy for that the content is there for me to um, share but it's just the time it's the time there. <laughs> It gotta be because I gotta do it all, you know? I gotta do it all. This is what I wanna do, and so I gotta do it. All right, hey guys, so I am off of work. As y'all can tell, I'm off of work. And um, I am on my way to Target because we need a couple of things for the house. So I'm on my way to Target. It is raining right now, or just got done storming. Am I focused? Okay. I don't know if y'all can see me. But I'm on my way to Target, like I said. And I forgot to get my garland from Big Lots. Okay, y'all remember if y'all watched the last vlog, I got this garland from Big Lots. It was only like eight bucks. But I'm second guessing how bright it is. Y'all know me. I'm I'm more so the neutral muted color majiggy going on. And even though that garland screams fall to me, I feel like it's too bright. Like I know I said I wanted something to bring out my fireplace, but I feel like that just does too much. Like I feel like it's just doing too much for me and I don't know if I want that. So I was gonna bring it back today, but um, I forgot the receipt the receipt I forgot the item I just left my house and completely forgot to pick it up so what I'm gonna do is just look at at home 
because that's why I, I saw like some really cool garlands for like around the same price. Um, I'm gonna look at at home today uh, after I come from Target and see what they have as far as garland goes, and then I will take my other wreath back tomorrow. Not wreath, I keep calling it wreath. I'll take my other garland back tomorrow or something like that. So, yeah, y'all. Um, that's all I had to say. But I'll talk to you guys once we get inside Target. All right, guys, I'm at Marshall's. Um, I'm in their beauty section because I, I always sleep on their beauty stuff. I heard that they have stuff like, see, they have like eye creams and stuff for cheap. So I wanted to come here to check out some of their stuff because I low-key forgot how much cheaper their stuff is. But I don't know what I want. Like, I don't know what I need. Um, oh, you know what I need? I do need tweezers. Let's see how much I need. I don't need tweezers for $10. I need tweezers, but not. Oh, these are like three ninety nine, dollars And you get two of them. You get two different guys. Oh, these are cute. Ooh, these are cute for only three ninety nine. Okay, get us some tweezers. I've been needing some tweezers. Oh, they have this color too. Cute. Okay. Some tweezers. I forgot they have like makeup, and wipes, and stuff. I know they have a lot of hair care products for cheaper too. Oh, I was looking for one of these. Why didn't I just come to Marshalls? I was definitely looking for one of these. But I already have one now. So. Oh, I used to always come here and get like the chai or whatever, chi, chai, chi, chi stuff. I used to always come here and get it because it was super cheap. Like this was only $3.99. Their stuff is really cheap here. This is what I used to always get. The silk infusion? Oh, had me in chocolate, chow. Uh -oh. I'm gonna see if they have any candles. Let's see if they have any fall candles. Oh, they have some Halloween stuff. Not a lot, but they have some Halloween stuff. This is cute. Oh, these are cute. They're really cute. And they have some pumpkins. Oh. This is really cute. Like this velvet pumpkin. Probably a name. It's really cute. Not velvet. What is this? So shut up. Green candles, bingo. Let's see what they have. Let's see this one, pumpkin cheesecake, $9.99. Mmm, smells so good. Ooh, golden nutmeg. Why is the sticker right there? $7.99 only, golden nutmeg. Let me see. Mmm, this one smells good. Apple cinnamon. Mmm, smells good. They have this one called Autumn Morning. I don't like that. That doesn't smell good. Pumpkin spice. Mmm, smells good. $7.99. Look how cute it looks. Mmm, ooh, and it's wooden stick. Mmm. Look at this one, cider donuts. Ooh, I'm getting this one. It smells so good. Cider donuts, yes. They have a whole bunch of these different pumpkins. I mean pumpkins, candles. But look at this aesthetic of them. Super cute. Look at this, Macintosh apple. 
Mmm. Too thick. Y'all, they have nothing at Target. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, but look at these cute sweaters. Oh my God, this one, so cute. But y'all, they have nothing at Target. Like, y'all think I'm playing? Y'all think I'm playing when it comes to this decor? Like, seriously? People came and took all that decor and they didn't even get to finish putting it out. They are not playing this year when it comes to decorating. Everyone's buying up everything. Like, everyone's buying up everything, literally. That um doll, that dollar section, bullseye section in Target, y'all, gone. Nothing's there, nothing. Excuse me. They just buying up everything. I'm just sitting here like, wow, what the heck? What's going on? <laughs> Ooh. Okay, I don't know what's going on with Target, but there's nothing in Target. Like, you know how you come to Target, they have good days, but today is a bad day because they don't have nothing up in this store. I gotta come back. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm not at home in the floral section because I'm looking for some garland. Now, I do see these, they're only five feet, which is cute. Or this one, which is like a subtle color. Um, I don't know, it's only $6.99. So, let me grab one just to see if I like it on the fireplace because it's like that natural color. I don't know. They have the cotton, but I don't really care for the cotton. And then I already had this one, but I think it's too bright. I think it's too bright. I'm going to take it back. Um, I'm going to see how this one looks. I want something on my fireplace, but not too, like, fall-y, I guess. I don't know. I want something, like, subtle. I don't know. This is cute. This this wreath is cute. I wish they had a garland like that. I feel like they're not gonna be able to see this too good on my fireplace because it's just like you know what I mean. It's just so thin. Oh crap! Let me put it back. I just don't think it's gonna look right either. It's gonna be too small. Oh, they have more fall stuff though. They have like their fall pillows. They even have some blankets, some potpourri. They have more stuff out. These wooden serving dishes inside um, trays and stuff like that. It's cute. And then all their fall stuff. More fall stuff. They didn't have. A lot of this last time I came, so I'm just showing you guys this again. This pumpkin's pretty, but yeah, they had. I showed you guys this stuff. They had that, but they ha didn't have any of this. This was like empty. They have a lot more Halloween stuff, like a lot more. That's the skull that I purchased. Let's see. They have a lot more Halloween. They even have pillows, like the skull pillows. They didn't have that last time I came more um decorative pillows and then i think they had these the last time but they didn't have blankets now they have blankets this thing is huge and then they even have more of these outdoor things they didn't have that last time they came they only had like one of them a lot more Halloween stuff. So they, I showed you guys these signs last time, which are like the house signs, but now they have the fall ones too. Like the fall outdoor signs that they have. I don't I think I want to get one. This one's cute. Oh my gosh, sweater weather. This one's super cute, only $11.99. Oh my gosh, I think I want this one to put in my house, in front of my house. 
like where my tree is at. We have a tree in front of our house. So I think this is cute. And then more Halloween stuff. This is cool. This is really cool. Really, really cool. Yeah, that's it. They're still putting out stuff. Let's light again. Back to the store. I'm so tired. Right, so I'm gonna show y'all what I got. Even though y'all probably got, already saw, but I have to do my whole, y'all know, I take y'all to the store with me, and then I come back home and do a full haul. I gotta put these cookies down. So Target really quick. Oh, hope I didn't break it. Some trash bags, I need trash bags. Mouthwash, this is the one we use now. It's the Thorough Breath Oral Rinse. Oh yeah, I got I get the pink kind, cause I we tried the green one. I don't like the green one, so I always have to get the pink one. It's Sparkle Mint. I don't know if you can see Sparkle Mint. Um, there's no alcohol, no artificial flavors or colors in this. So it's a healthier um, mouthwash. It is on the pricier side, but I love this. So I got this. And then, oh my gosh, I'm so freaking happy I got this. Like, so freaking happy. Um, I saw this on McKenna's YouTube vlog. Um, and she said she saw it on Kyra. So both of them, Kyra and McKenna, like influenced me to get this because it smells so good. It's the Method um, Hand Wash. It's in the scent Violet and Lavender. So um, supposedly it smells like the um, Le Labo Santal and it smells so good. Like, oh my gosh, so freaking good. Had to get it and I love the aesthetic of it because most hand washes are sold in like ugly plastic looking containers or bottles. This one is so chic. So got this. Say hi. Macy wants to say hi. Yeah. Oh, my heart can say hi too. Because people don't think we have older kids. They always say, what, why is all, it's only Macy? What about your older kids? <laughs> Macy lost her hair thing, so it's, it's up on, there. It's all right, come say out. hi, because people don't think you exist. Come say Mom, hi. Why, my, my hair thing is on the house. Yeah. It's, move, on, move. It's, it's on the couch. Okay, there's Mahari. People don't think our older kids exist because they're never on camera, but they're older. Macy is always around and wants to be on camera. So, for those who keep asking, where are your other kids? They're here, they're here. Why wouldn't they be here? They're just not always on us like Macy. Camera died, but I ended up getting some tweezers. These were only $3.99 and I needed some tweezers because I ran out. These ones have the slanted and the fine point. So two tweezers for $3.99, that's a good deal. And they're cute. So got these at Marshall's. I think I know how to get a candle, I showed y'all, but. The, I, ended up, I thought I was gonna get two of them, but one of them didn't smell that good once I got to the checkout. So I was like, nah. So the one that I actually ended up getting was the cider donuts and this was only $7.99. It's wooden wick at that too. So yeah, that's all that I end up getting. It's the next morning and my husband <laughs> <laughs> made a beautiful breakfast babe explain your meal okay guys so <laughs> babe don't say it like that this right here is a plant-based vegan why are you so loud <laughs> um that's how you guys be doing on youtube all right this is a plant-based vegan <laughs> sweet potato pancake basically what i did was i oh, babe Talk regular. All right, I, all right, you sure? <laughs> yeah. You might lose some polish. So look, no. that's what I did. I took some um, sweet potatoes. I baked them joints. You know what I'm saying? Took the skin off, mashed them up like this. Uh, added some um, what did I add? Some uh, cinnamon, nutmeg. No, 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 no. Okay. Chill out. Let me handle this. Okay, well, I'm gonna Babe, you take it forever. You told me to do it. So I added this right here and some baking powder. I added some whatever flour. And uh, I'll mix that up in here. Oh, and some vanilla extract right there and mix it up in here. 
and cooked it right there somewhere. Um, and then for the topping, I did bananas. I did these bananas with some pecans, lemon juice, and nutmeg. And a little bit of cinnamon. They got all and that then I water. heated this up on the stove because my girl Heat likes it. her syrup hot. My wife, I'm sorry, likes her syrup hot. And of course you can't go wrong with um, um, watermelon. We have watermelon, watermelon, blueberries, some blueberries at least. And then what's mine, what's mine? You have a banana um, pancake. So basically I took the bananas, smashed those up, added the same ingredients that I just showed y'all. Um, and yeah. So let me know if you guys want to see more content like this. Make sure you hit the like, the subscribe, <laughs> and uh, make sure you comment because it helps the YouTube algorithm. Oh and if you guys want me to make my own cooking channel, I can do that too. Okay. Thank you, babe. Uh, I just, you know, morning time now, so y'all excuse how crazy I look, but I'm going to taste test my food. I'm hungry. Mmm. Oh. Ooh, it's hot, y'all see that? Mmm. It's like a banana pancake. Wow, did you see that? Who is it? We didn't put no, um, it's just bananas? Yeah, it's bananas. No. no. It's only bananas? Mm hmm There's nothing else in them? Besides the uh, bacon powder and the, um, that Cause flour. Because I'm saying, because, um, you have to add it's something else to get it more, like. You know, I mushed it. Okay. You know, I mushed it and mixed it into the flour. The vanilla after it adds a little, you know, liquid to kind of make it a mix. Mmm. 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 And that's what's gonna be better. That's really good. I it's woke up this morning and my heart was making pancakes white. Alright, guys, it's later on. It's about 1.30. <sighs> I just had breakfast. My husband cooked us some breakfast. It was like this bomb. Well, he explained it to you guys <laughs> what it was. But yeah, that was a good little breakfast and surprise because. It was perfect. The mood was perfect. Saturday morning. Um, now that my body's on this new schedule, it's very hard for me to sleep in. It's very hard for both of us to sleep in. Even Macy, like she doesn't sleep in like that. Our older daughter doesn't sleep out, sleep in like that. So on the weekends, I'm normally up by 8 a.m. or 7 a.m. Like I just cannot sleep in on the weekends, even if I wanted to. So we just woke up and then I did clean the house. Like I mopped our floors and cleaned the kitchen and stuff. And then my husband cooked this breakfast. And now I just threw on something because I'm about to go to a couple of stores. Dollar Tree, Goodwill, and Publix, Bath and Body Works. Because Bath and Body Works has a candle sale that I'm just like, ugh. Because you guys know we went to Marshall's yesterday, right? We went to Marshall's yesterday and we ended up getting the candle for $7.99. Now, it's wooden wick, so I don't feel too bad, but Bath & Body Works has a sale for $6.50 for their single wick candles, and they're all fall scents, so you know I'm about to run it up. I'm about to go in there, and I wanna stop by the Dollar Tree because I'm looking for like these things that we need, these pancake molds. I don't know if that's what they're called, but you know how you put a pancake in the pan and it's never like perfect? Well, to be honest with you, I learned the trick on how to pour pancakes in the pan and get it to be a perfect circle. Um, I just literally just pour it slow like this in the middle and then it fills out. But my husband wants the actual mold. Like he wants like something that you can pour in and has a perfect circle with different sizes and different shapes. So I'm gonna see if they have that Dollar Tree, but if not, I'm gonna look on Amazon. And I just need a couple of things. I just wanna look around at um, Dollar Tree. And y'all already know why we're going to Bath and Body Works. And then Publix, I have to get some dinner for tonight. Um, so I have to go to Publix again. <laughs> and then I wanna go to Goodwill because I want to revamp my closet. You see, like, my closet. 
Um, I want to revamp that because I have just clothes that I'm not going to wear anymore and I just need to purge them coming for fall because y'all it's August and like I get so hyped when August comes because then I know it's September and September is <laughs> it's just uh, I can't wait so I want to look at Goodwill because I know they used to have like these really nice blazers like it used to be a place where you can find like blazers because nowadays it's so hard to find like a good blazer that is not expensive so I'm gonna check the Goodwill and yeah that's all I have planned for today before I head out I'm gonna try on a couple of items that I got from Amazon one is this black dress you guys ask me on my Instagram all the time like where's your outfits come from they're so cute and basic and like throw on and easy so I'm gonna try on a couple of outfits for you guys now so you can see what I've been buying for the past couple of months okay so while I'm here this is the black dress I love this dress because it comes with pockets it's like a tank top summer dress but it's really flowy and loose and the back has like this cute deep plunge as well as in the middle i honestly don't even like wear a bra with this you guys i literally just throw this on out the door like it's not something that i pay too much attention to because it's just minimal it's really minimal really basic um it's not too short if y'all can see it's not too short i just think it's like cute to you know throw on i got the same one in this nude color because why not why not get the same one in a nude color super cute super simple it is this like what i don't know knit material t-shirt material i don't know it's really cute um i love it i don't have a bra so i'm like covering up but yeah, it's super cute. I love it. Same thing with the plunge neck, plunge back, really loose fitting. Again, super simple to um, wear something with and dress up or down. So yeah, I got this one too. These were like the black one and this one was about $21 each, $20 each, very affordable. So yeah all right this next one is like a workout outfit kind of um it has like the cut out booby area which also comes with like the breast pads so like if you don't want these breast pads in here you can take them out and this material is ribbed it's like a really cute ribbed material very very stretchy very very stretchy material super cute i love it kind of bloated but whatever um y'all the armpit cleavage it doesn't matter how much i weigh i will always have armpit cleavage okay but um really cute simple um shorts and outfit super cute this is more so like going to work out pilates or something running errands after that trendy two-piece look so yeah this was I believe same price I swear these pieces were like 25 bucks no more than $30 because I wouldn't have paid for it so everything like together was no more than 30 bucks y'all know I tried on the joy laps from Target and just for the shorts alone was 30 bucks so good deal these are good dupes um, super cute so yeah this is my other outfit okay you guys have probably already seen this outfit because this was like tiktok viral outfit a lot of girls have this two-piece like off shoulder slanted crop um it comes in this like cream color i don't know if y'all can tell but it's in this like cute cream color it's not white it's actually cream so i absolutely love it sorry but yes, yeah, two-piece outfit. Everything is a size small. I don't know if I mentioned that, but everything is a size small. The shorts are longer, which I like. Like, they're almost to my kneecaps, which I like. Yeah, I think it's super cute. I think it's a super cute two-piece. The neckline detail really got me sold. So, yeah, I think it's cute. Again, it was 20 bucks for the same thing top and bottom 20 bucks again everything is a size small if you are wondering i will have it linked below but yeah everything is a size small okay and this is the last outfit um it is one of my favorites i love the color you guys probably have already seen this one um this is definitely more of like a workout outfit versus like 
Well, you could go running errands in this, but it, this is definitely more so like a workout outfit. I absolutely love it. Like the color, oh my gosh, I don't know if y'all can tell. I don't know if y'all can tell. Let me close this blind up a little bit. <sighs> y'all see, look at the color. It's like this deep orange. I mean, it's like this deep yellow, but orange color. It's like a very dark yellow. If y'all can tell, it's very dark. It's not super bright and it is very stretchy very stretchy um super cute i love the detail on the back i love the detail of the crop top this is a leggings outfit so the leggings are super long on me um i don't know if y'all can tell very much so this outfit was same price around 20 bucks 25 dollars no more than that 30 bucks between 20 and 30 it's no more than that um size small again it has the breast pads in here you can take them out which i love you know some companies don't be doing that so you can take the the breast pumps the breast pads out if you want to but yeah this was my last one i absolutely love it very basic minimal um workout cute outfits to wear all right guys we're out of here <laughs> Why did I sneak out the house? Um, well, I didn't really sneak. I ran out the house. My husband and Macy were taking a nap. And I was like, girl, go. This is your moment. This is your time. Go. <laughs> so I ran up out of there. Ooh, yes. <laughs> so, yeah, we're on our way to the stores. It is so hot outside. It's 92. 92. It's crazy because I think everywhere is hot. You know what I mean? Like, I think everywhere, not everywhere, obviously, like everywhere in the world, but I believe a lot of places are hot right now. Like, in the U.S., it's a lot of people experiencing heat. U.K., London, they were, like, experiencing a lot of heat. It's just hot. Like, it is just hot. I don't mind that first peak of summer where it's hot you're all excited you're like oh pool time pool days like yeah but when it's like super hot no like all right now it's been 100 degrees since may i don't want no heat no more like i've been hot since may i don't want to be hot anymore like I've been hot since May I'm over it I don't want to be hot no more like I'm over it sorry if it's loud you guys my fan I have the AC on but like I don't want to be hot no more because it's been hot since May I'm drinking my Starbucks um what kind is this black cherry limeade this is the only one I have left so really good um like i said it has coconut water coconut water fruit juice and caffeine so yeah it's really good but yeah y'all okay so i'll get back on camera let me drive i'll get back on camera once we get to the store all right y'all i'm at good bro right and i found this blazer seven dollars you see that seven twenty four This is what I was looking for. So cute. Oh my gosh, with some jeans and loafers. Oh, getting it. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna get this blazer and then I found these bowls. Let me show y'all. These bowls, if you can sit. Look, a dollar nine. A dollar, focus a dollar and I. So cute. Comfortable stuff. Fall time's coming up. Pumpkins. Everything, y'all. Super cute. Like, super, super cute. Um, I like a bunch of furniture. If you guys like repurposing stuff, this is definitely where to go. Hmm. I want to try on their jeans. 
um, because it's like six bucks. Oh my gosh. I wonder if they have any like mom jeans, but like I can't try them on. So, kind of sucks. If they don't fit, I'm gonna be scared because I can't return them. I don't think. Let's see, I would love to wear some mom jeans. Ugh. Some American Eagle jeans right here. Mm, I don't know. I guess I'll just like hold off on the jeans. I can go somewhere else for the jeans just because I'm scared it won't fit. I can only get jeans for certain places. Because if not, it'll be a disaster and a waste of time because they will not fit or, you know, something. Okay, well, I am gonna head into the line because I don't see anything else that I want. So, yeah, I came and I conquered. I got what I wanted, so. Geology. Look at these bowls. It's like a little marble thing going on. And then they have the plates to match. Super cute. Super cute. Oh, and then they have so much fall stuff still. Um, I don't know if I should get a cart or not. I have these two. I like these little clear, I mean, white mugs. Something about them is cute. These little guys. Super cute. All oh, their fall stuff. So cute. Oh my gosh. So much fall stuff. Literally five bucks. Oh my gosh, it's literally only five dollars. I like this one too, though. This welcome sign. This welcome sign. It's really cute too. Cute little acorns. Oh, all their fall stuff, y'all. Yeah. Cute little signs. Pumpkins. All these different pumpkins. Oh, this is cute. This is three dollars. This too. Happy fall, y'all. Three dollars. Ooh, they have velvet pumpkins. All the pumpkins are five dollars. Bats or anything. Look at this inflatable. It's only five dollars. So much. There's so much decor in Dollar Tree. Oh, look at the freaking activities they have for the kids to do. Like, is it too early to get Macy this? <laughs> she can literally paint her own scarecrow, color fall. Like, seriously, she could do all kind of stuff. All the activities. Oh my gosh. I, I want to get this stuff now because I feel like it's going to be gone when I want to do it actually um, with Macy they even have this you can make your own little um, foam crack kit oh my gosh super cute super cute I'm going to come back and grab a whole bunch of these I feel like I can do it with Macy on the weekends or weekdays after school They have this one too where you can make your own pumpkin. 
so cute. Make your own ghost. So cute. Okay, I'm at the grocery store at Publix. I just need to grab some shrimp and what else did I say I need, guys? Some shrimp and I don't mm, I already have uh, rice <laughs> and broccoli. I guess I just need the shrimp. Yeah, we're gonna get cake. Yes, ma'am. I don't know what else I need. I have broccoli at home already. I have rice. I'm so mad because I think I need an aluminum pan. So I have to go all the way back to the Dollar Tree to get an aluminum pan. Ugh. I'm so mad. But I think I'm done. So, yeah. Okay, Shiny. Back from the store. Oh, I don't want my freaking thing to fall. Please don't fall because you know this camera be collapsing. Back from the store is just in time because I feel like it was gonna be pouring if I was out there any longer. Um, so, oh my shrimp! I got some shrimp for later. Y'all saw that at the grocery store. I'm about to put that in some cold water. Hold on. I want it to be. I got a plate cover for the microwave. This is something that we've always needed, but I never get it. I never pick one up and we need one for the microwave because I'm tired of things splattering. So I got a plate cover, $1.25. And then I found these for the oil and vinegar. I'm about to put the labels on it. I'm about to put the labels on it now, these two for the oil and vinegar so that I can. I already bought labels. You don't need labels on oil and vinegar, but it's all about the aesthetic. It makes sense. Like if it's in here, why would I not put they fit perfectly? Oh well, they don't fit perfectly, but if they're in here, why the heck? Yeah, see? Why the heck would you not have labels on that? But you just go in there and goes on the counter. You want it on the counter? I'll put it on the That's counter too. Still. You can put it right here. Or here. Doesn't matter. Still have labels on it. Well, I didn't say it needed it. I said there's going to be labels on it, and that's just the end of it. Pizza cutter, dollar twenty-five, because you know nothing's a dollar at Dollar Tree anymore. So I need this dollar twenty-five. Um, something simple, small. We got, we just been needing a pizza cutter. I'm tired of using knives, so just needed a pizza cutter. And what else? Oh. Uh oh. Oh, come on. Aluminum pan because I'm cooking the shrimp tonight, so I need a aluminum pan. So y'all know Dollar Tree. Just something these are disposable anyway, so a dollar. What else did I get? Some sandy wipes from the Dollar Tree. These actually fight off. Look at all the um, viruses they fight off. E. coli, salmonella, salmon, salmonella, yeah, E. coli. What else does it fight off? Uh, coronavirus, flu, so got these, I don't know. I just got them um, in the Dollar Tree. I got these rolls from the Goodwill. There was only a dollar nine each really cute ones to put stuff in set stuff in council table stuff this is going to go on the council table um to put some stuff in or whatever so y'all know decor items so yeah these two cute it's been thundering and lightning every day okay like almost every day and then the blazer i told you i showed you guys let me go it is storming, so this is the blazer I got. I'm gonna wash it. 
um, it's really wrinkled, but with some mom jeans and stuff, really, really cute. My hair is gonna be different because I'm gonna get take out these um, curly clippings, but super, super cute and detailed. Definitely the style I was going for. Yeah. Okay, I have to be quiet about this one, but these things I got from AC. They're these felt craft activity sheets. I'm talking low so she won't see them and like, like I have to do it now. I got the ghost one, and then I got the pumpkin one. Just some activities that we can do at home. And then I got this one that says Hello Fall. But it actually comes with paint. How cute. It's a canvas. It's a little easel canvas thingy. So cute. All right, this is just a demo, but look at look at this. Okay, this is the bowl from the Goodwill for $1.09. Um, these pumpkins came from Hobby Lobby, I think. Oh, I'm not sure. This pine cone and like winning balls came from Target. This came from Amazon, so. Look at this. Something like this on a console table. This is what I'm talking about, $1.09 for this bowl. And I have another one too that's smaller. So cute. Literally so cute. just because it matches with everything. And it looks so cute. I'm so obsessed, y'all. These labels are just, oh, super aesthetic and cute. The flower, oh, my daughter used it earlier, but whatever. <laughs> so cute, oh, I love it. Everything is still organized. I absolutely love it. And that's how these little, this little, oil thing came out super cute love it only a dollar 25 y'all you guys saw last week i organized the kitchen so now i just added this and it came out super cute i'm obsessed i love it I am tired, like I was just laying down on my bed so my hair is kind of messed up, but 
It's 8 12. I'm cleaning up the kitchen. I just love cleaning, y'all. Yeah, I don't know what it is about it. It's a little therapeutic, but I love cleaning. And <laughs> even though it's tiring, I still love cleaning. And I cleaned up. It doesn't even look. Look at outside. Like it doesn't even look like it's. It just looks so bright outside. It doesn't even look like it's 8 o'clock. Look. Doesn't even look like it's 8 o'clock, but I'm just tidying up. Um, cleaning off the counters and stuff. Y'all know, after you cook, you gotta be squeaky clean. I'm gonna clear off those counters, but y'all know, it got to be squeaky clean. But yeah, um, I'm gonna finish doing that real quick and then get into my pajamas and lay down. I think I'm gonna start Pretty Little Liars tonight, the new one. I've been binge watching the old one, like all the episodes, and I'm just like, is it okay if I start the new one or should I just finish the old one? Like, what do I do? Because I want to watch the new one. So, um, yeah, I have all my stuff right here, y'all. But anyways, hopefully you guys enjoyed this vlog. You guys like the long vlog, so I'm giving y'all the long vlog. So hopefully y'all watch them and like them. Because baby, I ain't doing this for nothing. <laughs> But if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. Please subscribe to my channel. We are trying to get 10K, so please subscribe, y'all. And make sure your bell is on so you can be alerted whenever I post a new video. Hopefully you guys enjoy your week ahead of you. Back to work, back to school, wherever you go in. Enjoy. <laughs> and I will see you in my next vlog. Bye.